Hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Paper Mario. Super Paper Mario, that's the name of the game. <laughs> I mean, honestly, you could just do these intros saying Paper Mario, and it'd, it'd be right, like... Yeah. Anyway, the last one we got to the new chapter, went through this, like, sunset paradise little area, went to a mansion, saw some bitch named Mimi, and now we're more into the mansion. Yep. Yeah. And, and this shit kind of got a kind of got a jam going on. It's going. Doo, doo, doo. Are you not gonna? What? The, I'm just looking around. The block that had a face on it. I'm just looking. It's a reception desk. <laughs> what? I was just looking around. Well, what? You want me to go go up there? No, I want you to hit this block. Okay. more than anything, and you broke it. Oh, you'll pay for that. Yes, you will. I'll have you know that that face cost them one million rubies. So hand over that money now, or else you're done for. Rubies? Oh, I don't believe Mario carries any of that kind of particular currency. I don't suppose those are anything like coins, are they? Coins? Who uses coins anymore, you peasants? I spit on your coins. <laughs> So what are you- She does that little hawk too on the- on the coin! <laughs> oh gosh, that, that, that girl has to be the most overrated, like... You know she was a teacher and she got fired because No, that was- that was a myth. She's like 21 years old. Wait, really? That was a myth? I can't believe I fell yeah, for that. Yeah, that's, that's just- that's just some bullshit. She's literally 21. How could she have been a teacher? I don't know. So what are you saying? Are you saying that you don't have any rubies at all? Well, guess what? You're just gonna have to work it off then! Until you work up your day, you naughty little things, I own you. I bet a lot of people would enjoy that. Enjoy labor! Yes, so if you earn enough rubies from the generator room on the top floor. Once you earn one million rubies, you can pay it off in the room in the back. You can also check the balance of your debt there, so get to work, servants! Mario's now saddled with a one million ruby debt. Whoa! <coughs> That's crazy. Oh my gosh, it actually shows you. Yeah. What did she say? Top floor? Yeah. This one? Jump little fleas! Oh shit. Where'd those little skinny flea legs? Now burn it! Jump to the minute! Boss Mimi hates the dark! Like she hates Brussels sprouts, so work it! More power! Do I get to talk to this guy? Yes, this is the generator room. Hip blocks make rubies, make energy earn rubies, duh. Rubies make the world go up and down, round and round. Do you want to work here? Yeah, sure. Uh, love the energy kit. Just find an unusable block and jump like you mean it. Now day another ruby. Huh, rubies are alive. Huh, jump ruby, jump ruby. When you're done jumping, you come to talk to me, I'll tell you how many rubies you earned. I don't know, watch for that mo motivational sparks that travel along the floor. Yeah, this is a grindy mission. You want me to do it? No, I can do it. We just gotta talk about random things. Like today was my sister's birthday. Yep, yes and, it was. And she dyed her hair brown, so she looks like a, a, a younger version of myself. Why did she do that? I don't know. I saw it. I'm like, oh god. <laughs> no, I'm not saying it looks bad by any means. I'm just curious why she decided to do it. I don't know. Hey, it could have been worse. She could have died of her orange. What do you mean by that? <laughs> I'm just saying there's uh, worse things than being a ginger, you know? Worse? Huh? Oh, I meant the other way around. <laughs> there's nothing worse than being a ginger? Yeah, that's right. Man, I'm like edging those sparks. I'm like one pixel off. That <laughs> pixel? Like the, the pixels that we have in our inventory. <laughs> yeah, the ones that I hate. Also, I love how he's whipping, but he's not whipping anyone. It's just hearing the sound that motivates people. <laughs> I don't know about that. If I heard someone whipping over there, I'd just be like, Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I got my jump, 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 I, I, jump. I got my sister a $25 gift card. 
Damn. I mean, nowadays, like, it's so hard to buy gifts for people. No, it's real easy. My sister's just picky. Like, if I, if my birthday was coming up, or like, my, like, Christmas or shit, you would know exactly what to get me. You just go on my Etsy page, and then you'll see all the shit that I want. I mean, yeah, you have, you have pages like that, but it's so hard because you keep stuff on there that you've already bought. No, I always take them off after I buy them. No, there were some things on there that... You literally had a, a plush on there that I bought for you that... Oh, the Souls one? Uh, no, not that one. Didn't you have the... Or no, I guess that was... No, that was not Etsy. Anyways, uh, there's definitely been something that I bought you before that you have not taken off. Because I remember complaining about it. I just can't remember. Oh, off the, the Pomni thing? No, not that one. Uh, that was the one that I was referencing, but that that wasn't the one on like on there. Yeah, I'm trying to think like what was on Etsy that was a plushie, or was it not a plushie? It might not have been a plushie. Yeah, because I don't I don't buy plushies off of Etsy. No, I did once, but it was a box thing. You wouldn't have bought me that. <laughs> yeah. How many rubies do we have? Well, let's go check. Is it like a hundred per? I have per no idea. Are you? Fucking. We did how much? We did five minutes of labor. What happens if you actually grind out a million? I don't know if anyone would willingly do that. To be completely honest with you, but there's ways to cheat the system. Came here to get a romantic fortune read. Okay, you know, to see the future me and a gal. But I never met Marley, and now I'm never gonna see my sweetie again. Cruel fate. What's this room? Can we gamble our 240 and turn it into a million? Is this the break room? New fleet, huh? Hey, did you know there's a VIP room as well as a normal one? You can earn rupees way faster there than the entry level flea jumping room. There's a problem though, you need a passcode to get in and only members know it. Man, if only I knew that passcode. <laughs> Juicy info, I got it. Want it? I'll tell you for one ruby. What do you say? Yeah, fuck it. Here's the skinny. In this mansion, there are lots of hidden passageways. Yeah! Check all walls. Check both sides. Up, down, left, right. Leave no corner unchecked. What do you have to say? I work and work, but I can never grub enough rubies to pay off my debt. I gotta tell you, I don't know if I ever got this creepy place. Oh! There's a guy here! Fine timing, friend of mine. I just got hold of some very delectable info. You're timely, so it's yours. I was gonna charge 10,001 rubies, but for you, 10,000. Sound good? Uh, we don't have that kind of money. Well, we got a hint. Check all around. Alright, let's check all around and rip some people off. Oh. I smell rubies up ahead, and lots of them. But see these electrified barriers? They'll turn you into roast gerbil surprise. If only I had one of them slenderizing pixels I heard about. Heard of them? If you use one of them, you turn sideways, which makes you practically invisible. And I think there's one of them things sashed somewhere in this mansion. Yeah, we ain't make it through that. <laughs> yeah. But we got a hint to yeah. go find a slenderizing pixel. Do you think he's in this level? <gasps> no. Oh, that sucks. Wasn't there another door over here? <laughs> we turn to Peach and glide over there. You're so right. Yeah, you know what, Peach? You need to do some manual labor. Peach doesn't have a debt. I think she does. <laughs> What's in this door? I meant to talk to Nicely that guy. Done. I meant to talk to the guy. <laughs> I'm pulling a uh, Cameron right now. Hey, new grub. You want to learn a little secret? Yeah, I bet you do. Just slip me a hundred rubies. I'll tell you something good. Honest. It's prime information. Pay the man. Your mom taught you to trust the angels, huh? Yeah, solid parenting right there. Well, turns out she's a smart cookie. I'll give you, give you the VIP room code. Secret code is 5963. 5963. What's good is it? Yep. Secret. Just remember, 5963, you dribble. Thank you later. 5963, 5963. Mmm, 
Chelsea! Eating mushrooms is the only pleasure allowed in this horrible factory. I don't know if I could go on without my sweet little fungi. I don't like that. If you are fully prepped, you ought to go to hit the generator room and get back to work. Wait, do you just get infinite? Yeah. Oh, oh wait a minute, hold on. It costs 10 ru rupees! Uh oh. I was like, is it free? No. Ooh. Oh, whoa. Oh, is this the slenderizing pixel? You know the secret? Cause I do! So, you wanna know a secret part? Well, do you? If you close up your peepers and listen real hard, that the world's gone? Why well, is just about the biggest darn thrill ever? Would you who? My senses are telling me that you're the hero. Whoa, well, welcome, partner. Got some bad news, though. Looks to me like you're lacking in thrills. I can't give my power to anyone to just. that was too skinny in the thrills apartment. I thought you meant just skinny in general. My Mario's not skinny. <laughs> so here's what we're gonna do, partner. I'll regenerate your thrill gauge over the next 10 seconds. You ready? Here it goes. One, two, three. Five, four, seventeen, three point one four, one more zillion, ten. I'm not very good at count. <laughs> I fucked out of school. <laughs> Here, y'all, it's hard to find, partner. Peeper, now you got your thrills. Now remember, we pickers got levels of power, so you best be real careful with us. We had a little dust up with them ancients two thousand years ago, but we're partners now. So let's get to some thrills and look at my own! The sideways pixel named Slim has joined your pard. You can use Slim's power to turn sideways and avoid traps or enemies. And when you're sideways, you don't take any damage as long as you stay still. So what you... What you say now, pard, don't you? Play hide and seek... Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Play hide and seek is the biggest thrill you can find. You ought to try it. So, Your reading comprehension goes to the level of like a two-year-old when when you try and do an accent. That's the rudest thing you've ever said to me. And how does it make you feel? Like I want a cookie. <laughs> Ooh. Aw oh, shit. Blow it up! Yeah. <laughs> We're about to- Me when I see a building. Blow it up! I was just thinking that with like the Twin Towers. I was like, no, oh, I wasn't I thinking that. I was just thinking of a general building. Ooh. I got a boo card. <laughs> and it's got you on it, because you're my boo. Alright, that was cringe. Okay. Well, anyway, we got the code for this. 5963. Pass code accepted. Please enter. Yeah, we're not poor bitches. We hit diamond blocks. Run, really gerbils? Run, ran, 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 she goes. And when I'll retire, no one knows. Me boss me, me hates the dark more than old hands, so move the little dribble legs. Power up. Oh yeah, I got the right I got the right guy for this. Hi. This is VIP general generator room. Run the wheel and make volts or cash. Yeah, major upgrade from the other room. You're in crazy rubies in here. So, a new gerbil, huh? Hungry for Ruby's gerbil? You wanna work here? Great, great, just hang on for a second for me. Move, gerbil, move! Alright, sometimes I wonder why I do this, but let me put work is fun, you ready? Good answer! Now get in there, gerbil, move! Aw, oh, shit. I think there's a thing we can do. It doesn't earn it very fast, though. I think if you get a, like... There we go! Oh hell yeah. Now we're earning. Yeah. Mario's good at butt stuff. Yeah. I wish I could slide on things with my butt like this. Why aren't all the other guys doing this? Instead, they're just running like little peasants. Where's my phone at? 
Oh, it's over there. You want to grab it? We have a couple comments to read from Turkish for the new Pokemon thing. All right, sure. It's right thing. there by the book. Yeah. I would hand this to you, but I'm afraid. <laughs> yeah, you're afraid to trust me with things. Cause I'm I'm a demon. I'm a devil, and I don't what know where I'm the going angels? with this. <laughs> Angel of dark. <laughs> All right, let me see. All right, from Turkish. From episode 40, he just said, What did you say about Levani? And I think we made fun of her. <laughs> There's a good chance of it. Alright, and then chapter in episode 39, Legendary Hunting, is finally I have a chance to watch these videos and comment on them. I love End Room. Combined with the OST that specifically only plays in that room is so perfectly unsettling. I believe I said this before, but Rushroom and Zekrom have a higher catch rate than other legendaries, so it's easy to catch them in a quick pull. And any other ball, for that matter. I believe they're easier to catch because they're required to catch them in order to progress the story, at least in the first game. Weirdly enough, Friend Ball and Luxury Ball don't have the same effect on Pokemon. Luxury Balls increase the friendship gained after catching a Pokemon, while Friend Balls gives a boost to the friendship only when it's first caught. Hmm. Alright, and then... Yeah, Blue Banny, we said we, she sucks. Okay. From... Episode 41, Thunder isn't the move that hits Pokemon who are in the middle of using Fly, it's Hurricane. Which I feel like that's also true, but I feel like my answer's right. I think Thunder I've does too. Yeah, I remember doing that. Like, I remember someone using Thunder on me, and I'm like, ah, oh, fuck, and then I get killed because of a flying type. I'm, I, I mean, you could, you could look up the move Thunder, but yeah. um... The Abundant Shrine is not a shrine made for Celebi, so naturally bringing Celebi there does nothing. And then at 23 minutes and 52 seconds, Holy shit, it's the protect it's the Pokemon Coliseum protagonist. We battled a guy named Youngster Wes Wes. Oh, I guess yeah, I haven't played Pokemon Coliseum in a long time. Yeah, I never played it. Yeah. But um one one thing that I did want to say <laughs> is um uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you go ahead. I'm pretty sure with that, like I know we're playing a Mario game right now, but since we're sitting here just rambling on and on, uh, number one, love how there's an air conditioner in here, yeah. and number two, uh, I'm pretty sure all box art legendaries have a higher chance to be caught after a certain generation. I think that in the games, uh, normal legendaries have a catch rate of three, and box art legendaries actually have a catch rate of like 45. So they're actually pretty easy to catch. I can't remember if that's the right numbers, or if I'm right at all, but I'm pretty sure that's the way that it actually goes, and I'll look it up in just a second. Mm -hmm. But, um... You looking up Thunder? Yeah. Maybe it's under, like, Trivia. Uh... Sh Thunder can hit Pokemon during the semi-invulnerable turn of Fly, Bounce, or Sky Drop. Suck on that, Turkish! <laughs> yeah, right. I'm gonna I'm gonna screenshot it, snip it. Well, just and just like at Turkish. Yeah. And also, even if it wasn't uh, the case, I am pretty sure. Also, I think Hurricane also does do it too. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that since, uh, actually, I don't know about this. I don't know how this interaction works. But when it's raining, thunder always hits. Yeah, that's right. I don't know if, uh, if in that case, if it hits them during moves like dive and whatnot, I think it still misses. I think it still misses, cause it's like not going into the water, you know. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, I fucked it up. Well, I mean, here, go check how many rubies you got. Oh yeah, I gotta stop moving. Yeah. I'm tired. I'm a little guy. Stop being mean to me. Sage just messaged me out of mo nowhere and went, Sorry if this says odd, but are we still friends? And I'm like, bro, of course we are. What are you, me? <laughs> Holy shit! You're telling me that was only 8,000? Wait a minute, how many do we need for the other guy? You need 10,000 to learn the little secret, so we just need to do this a little bit longer. Oh, that's right. You want to try it? Yeah, I think run the opposite. And then... Yeah, you have to... There you go! 
You're doing it. And just hold that pose. Pose. Pose to the veins. Pose to the veins. You want me to do it? There you go. At Turkish. Haha, <laughs> 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 loser. <laughs> Don't say that because it's from my account. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Turkish, you're gonna watch this and know that I did that. Yeah, I hope so, or else Turkish is gonna have like a hatred for me. <laughs> I think Bethany is gonna have a hate crime for me. I mean, he, he already might hate me because I, I probably said some cruel things to Lee Vanny and Pokestar Studios. Yeah, you did. No, not for, during Perky Star Studios, during the fucking battle subway. You're like, God, why the fuck did you pull Lee Vanny in the front? She's fucking useless. Yeah, that sounds about right. I know he sent me one thing. I, we, we, oh, yeah, Lee Vanny was asleep during a battle, woke up, and, like, killed the watchdog, and I'm like, oh, fuck yeah! Turkish must be nutting himself right now. He's like, I'm, he's like, I'm doing what right now? I'm like, oh, I meant something else, like macadamia nuts. I'm like, I don't think you are. I don't even think you believe that. <laughs> okay, it's in that room in the in the three D. Cameron's playing right now. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I'm jamming out. I so I think you read for the guy. Hey, button. There you go. Uh, fine time, a friend of mine. I just got hold of some very delectable info. Time is so it's yours. I was gonna charge 10,001 rubies, but for you, 10,000. Sound good? Thanks, buddy of mine. Listen and listen good. Mimi was napping okay, and I heard her start sleep talking. She whispered, 412 Oh, fuck! Take a screen. Yeah, take a picture. Take a picture. <laughs> take a picture of the last long dude. I don't like the, the voice that you did for it. Me talking to myself in the mirror. Take a picture. Think it's your boyfriend's phone number or something? The <laughs> winning lottery number? I wish it was the winning lottery number. We'd be rich. Alright, what can we use that, that for? I have an idea. Good thinking! I love that we have $12.99 in rubies. It's like coins, but shit. You know, you can walk with it, right? And you go... <laughs> <laughs> what happens if you hit them? You get damaged. Uh oh. Access denied. Enter your passcode. Alright. It's four, two... Oh, one... Eight... And then there's a one and a six. Passcode accepted. Oh shit! Give me that shit. 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 I'm fucking rich. We're rolling it. You got one million rubies. speaking in, in in Animal Crossing. Sometimes you just gotta be like I'm gonna have a sandwich tomorrow for lunch. You know what? That's a good idea. You know what is a good idea? Oh hi there, big welcome! So happy to hear that the Ruby savings and loans. Gonna do this real quick. First off, thanks for taking out a special ruby loan. What can I do for you? 
Super! Let me just take all the rupees off your hands and here we go! Well, thank you so much for paying off your ruby loan in full. <laughs> what? How did you earn enough rubies to pay it off? That's not supposed to happen. No, you're supposed to be... You've broken my wonderful curse. Yeah. I'll get you. And my goal is to blow up and act like I don't know nobody. <laughs> so that young imp put a curse on this mansion then, but who was she really? I'm worried about Merle. We must hurry to her aid. Yeet! Oh, how are we gonna get- Oh my- Oh no, how are we- Oh no, how are we- <laughs> You're fucking kidding me. You did it! You solved the mystery of how to get by the thing! <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm no. so happy. I'm so happy I could eat a horse. Is that how the saying goes? No. It <laughs> <laughs> it's I'm so hungry I could eat a horse. What is this? The mysterious, <laughs> the mysterious head made Mimi disappeared in a bizarre explosion. What exactly was her plan, and why did she try to enslave Mario and friends? After the incident, Princess Peach noticed stairs going down. There we go! Oh, sorry. There we go! She said. I wonder if Merle's down here. Thought our heroes as they traded worried glances. The two solemnly made their way down, knowing there was no other path to follow. Chapter 2-4, The Basement Face-Off. Let's go. The pure heart's near. I can feel its tremors so much more strongly down here. Oh, all right, yippee. Thanks for coming to look for me. Beautiful, mysterious Merle, mistress of the house, it's me. So glad it's you, I see. So long I've waited for you. Your arrival is well past due. But we can't think meet like this. Oh no, for something's amiss. An evil one is after me, and safe and sound I cannot be. In the basement I do dwell. Maze-like rooms are my cell. You will find me, I can tell. And, if you do, take care, for your eyes may err, trust nothing, foul, foul or fair. She was like, fuck, I can't come up with it. <laughs> no, I can't last, my power is fading fast, the distance is too vast. Are you ready to find me? Beware, if you do, I plead. She's she, she still rhyming. Dot dot space. Dot dot space. Dot dot, dot space. You think it's binary? <laughs> you mean... It's not binary. It's a uh, Morse code. Yes. She's, or she's gone. Braille. Yeah, that's it. She's gone. I wonder if that operate. Apparition. Apparition really, really were. Fuck yeah. Just, was that really? <laughs> Why do you suppose she was telling us to be careful when we find her? I don't know. Not my problem. Anyway, Turkish just responded, but your thing by saying fuck. <laughs> What's behind door number one? And then Tur and then Elf is like, Turkish is wrong about Pokemon? And then Turkish went, the Turk situation is insane. <laughs> so the apocalypse is upon us. And Turkey went, I even double checked Bulbapedia to make sure my blind ass skipped on the line apparently. No excuses. Dilt to your honor. But Hurricane does hit Pokemon using fly. Alright, this is room three. Mm -hmm. This one's room two. two. Oh. You gonna kill it? Oh. <laughs> I thought we had to throw up. They give a lot of coins. Alright, up here. Slide to the left. And you slide to the right. Cr oh, Chris, draw! You, you're gonna have to go through 3D. You, you're gonna have to go through 3D. You know that one mini game in uh in Oh my Mar <laughs> Oh 
There you go. Of course I remember it. Room four. All right, this one's room four. So let's just keep going to the right then. Slide to the left. Oh, so slide to the left. And you slide. And you slide to the left. And you slide. And you slide. Slide, slide to the right. This is much harder to control than you'd think. You did it. You did it. You did it. Yeah. All right. Are we back where we started? Are we back right where we started 15 years ago? Room three. room 3, so we've been through up there on room 3, and we've been through here. Uh-huh. This leads us here. Have I been up here? I don't think so. No. Oh yeah, we can go across. We didn't go in the other door. What other door? There was a door, right? Oh, you mean? Not that one. I guess we can go that way. I don't remember the way, by the way. Okay, we're back at the start. <laughs> okay. So, I went through... Okay. Backtracking. I went through this door. Okay. So, this is the first door. This is room one. Mm -hmm. So, room one, we can only go over to the right. Mm -hmm. This so drops us down. here. We can't go up there. We're too short. Yeah. So this is room three. three. So we have to go over to the right on room three. Good. So this is room two. Well, if we go up, we go up there because wasn't there another door for us? And there was a hallway. We didn't look at that entire room before he jumped into another door. For what I remember. All right. This is room four. Yeah, go on that one. We didn't look at the entire room. Is it again? Dude, I'm a genius. Oh, wait. I think you need to jump on the wall. I already just do that. <laughs> Am I a big brain or what? <laughs> You're so big brain, Cameron. Oh, yes, how very nice. Thank you for coming. Thank you twice. Did I say that right? Mysterious and so lovely, mistress of the house. You, you see, it's me, Merle. This is not Merle. I shine on, must is my lot. A son in those fate to me brought. And I knew that soon, you see. I, wait, fuck. And I knew as soon I'll see. You buzz on by, little bees. He 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 he. Heart. Hi! We come to seek the pure heart. Oh yes, of course I know the pure heart for Mario and Co. For Wait, you... how does she know our name? Mm. For you, yes, I'm glad to part with that purest pure heart. Mm. But it's a wee fee, yes, yes, ten million rupees. Quite a bargain, you agree? So, folks. If you be dears, sign this dotted line here. It's yours, free and clear. Yeah, I think I'm good. If you lack rubies now, a smallish loan I can allow, you can work it off somehow. Just sign here, my dear. Okay, here's what we can do. I have a deal for you. Sign up for a loan and boom, a free gift, a wedding glue, a super mega ultra mushroom. Just sign here, my dear. Oh, fine, you bargain hard. I'll throw in a bread word, a pixel made of oats and lard. Isn't that so nice of me? I'm the best, don't you see? Here, dear, sign and cheer. Yeah. Idiots, the lots of you turning down such a coup. None of you have a clue. Here it is, your last shot. Sign right now on the dot. Good choice for my sake. This Merle's a total fake. Listen not, she's a snake. Oh, shit. Me, Now, put in trying to hide the- You don't want to experience the trauma I received as a kid? No, you, you can re-experience it. <laughs> wow, that's so fucked up! No point in trying to fool anyone now. <laughs> Look here, the girl that made you think she was a handmaid of Merle's imposter. She's actually the faithful servant of Count Black, master impersonator Mimi. Golly, I was hoping we could settle this peacefully, but too bad. Oh, you want to make things ugly, huh? Well, that's super. Let's get ugly. 
True Mimi, come forth! Yuck! Please, my friends, beware. A, a barrier protects her there. In fact, it's everywhere. I think attacks may be useless against such as she. Attacks will work, huh? What shall we do? Me, 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 me. I must suggest you flee. Come and find the real me. I'm hiding. Look and see. If you can, my magic may weaken her and win the day. Hurry, hurry, and don't delay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Is she shooting shit? She's stuck up there. She's shooting rupees. Oh shit. <gasps> Get shit on. That she's gonna be chasing us through this entire maze, by the way. Oh shit. Ow. And the music will pick up, letting you know that she's in the same room as us. The hell are you? What do you want? That's a Cursia. The spiteful evil monster curses everything it touches. I XP1 attack is one. This Cursia's curse slows you down temporarily. You can throw something at it or use an item. Jumping on it is a really bad idea. I see. There is a Cursia that if you touch it, you get sent back to, uh, <laughs> to flip side. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of fucked up. Yeah. But it's in like an early level, that way it's like like a, the first part of a chapter, so you're not like going to the fourth one and then having to retry. That's crazy. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, is that Lancer throwing shit? Oh shit, that's her! I was like, what is that? Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck! This way! Let's get out of here! She's shooting shit for her pussy! This one? That seems Quick. like an important passageway. Yeah, because it's square instead of round. So. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Oh shit, you're right! <laughs> There's shit around here. What? Okay. Oh shit, there is. Oh god damn it, this thing is hard. Me 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 Oh shit. Well, never mind. <laughs> you're gonna stand there for too long and you're gonna hear me, 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 me. <laughs> oh, thank god. Can I go piss now? Marty, I've been holding it in for a little bit. <laughs> I got to go. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You, yeah, POV, Mario's in the bathroom, wanking it. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Sorry. I love that imagery. What, a Mario jacking in the bathroom? Yeah. <laughs> you found me! The real Merle! I shine on, such is my lot, a son to those fate meet brought. The real Marley, truly, a place in a place like this? Did you almost fall off the bed? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm afraid that Mimi's that Mimi's freak was too robust and I am too weak. The pure heart I quickly took and hid where she would never look. But now you're here, hooray! 
This bad tide will turn today, soon that awful Mimi pays. You and I will join up to teach that tiny bratty pup a lesson. Now let's power up. Oh, I don't think so. Mimi! Mimi, 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 Mimi. Stop pretending to be me. No one, everyone knows that you're Mimi. Come on, friends, attack. We will drive her back. What is this you talk about? You're the faker and the lout. Don't be fooled by her act. Get her now. Now attack. It's me, the real Merle. No, it's me, the true Merle. Look at us very closely. One of us has real beauty and one is fake as can be. Oh, please, you make me gag. I am hot. No need to brag. And while well, you, well, you're a hag. <laughs> oh, what a fibber maker. You're such a fake faker. Oh, now, come off of it, dear. You're the dog from eye to ear, and your breath reeks, I fear. Big pig. Chow cow. <laughs> girl fight, girl fight. My, my bet's on, on Merle. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think Merle's gonna win. This is going nowhere, see? Let them pick a Merle and settle it, do you agree? Sounds like a good thought, because I'm the real me, hot, and you aren't not. <laughs> oh, how much you amuse. You're a fake, you will lose. <laughs> you're a fake, you stupid fake. We all know you're the snake. It's on, Con. It's a 66 annual, that's my Merle show! How you guys doing? <laughs> Let's get going, are you gonna- We are gonna ask these two Merlees a total of five questions! Listen closely to those answers, because at the end you're gonna have to pick the real one! Oh, but that's not all, pick the wrong, or we're gonna have some disastrous results! Now for our first question. And your birthday, what's the best food? What types? What guy's your type? What's the best animal? What's the best smell? What are you into? What What do you want most? What's your nickname? What do you, what do you wash? wash first? What's your best feature? Alright, what are you feeling? I kinda wanna ask where they wash first. Yeah, I do too. Oh, that question's a little risque, folks! What is the first thing you wash in the bathtub? Not that you must care, but I wash my bangs of hair. I start with the, the tile mold, but then the faucet hot and cold. Oh, very interesting! Now for the next question. Okay, what do you want to ask? When's your birthday? Oh, what's, what's Megs in the asking? Drumroll, please! When is your birthday? The day that I arrived? Oh, yes, March, day 25. I bloomed in May 5th. I bloomed in May, the 5th was the day. I can't rhyme. So, March 25th and May 5th. Yeah. Oh, indeed, indeed. Time for another question. What kind of guy you into? <laughs> Here, what kind of... We all want to know this one, am I right, folks? So drum roll, please! What type? What kind of guy is your type? Hee <laughs> hee, I love them all, see? No, nope, no type for me. Oh, how could I share when the guy's right there? Is she, is she talking about me? <laughs> <laughs> am I Merlee's type? <laughs> oh, what do you know? So. Next question, please. Alright, what do you want to ask? Um, what's the best animal? What a cute question! What is your favorite kind of animal? A little bear cub, just as cute as can be. Oh, cubby. An adorable little demon, all sweaty and steaming. <laughs> now time for our final question, folks, exciting! Which will it be? Uh, what do you want most? Ah, that's a great question! What do you want most right now? Crystal ball, the newest kind. Nice ones are hard to find. I want a boyfriend, please. I love a guy to squeeze. Oh, folks, it looks like we're all five questions. So, which one's the real Marley? Search your minds, guess. Let's have a guess. Wait, what is that, like, fly that's around? Oh, she was in the bathroom. Yeah, remember when she came out of the toilet, she had a fly on her? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That was- that's supposed to be your hand. Are you sure about that? Wait, is this supposed to say the- th this is the real one? We're, we guessed. Well, I'm not. 
Well, there's suspense! Let's see it! The one you picked is the real Merle! A faithful... A faithful moment, folks! I'm on pins and needles! Ding! Right! Hehehe! <laughs> well, of course! Obviously, no one can copy me! Stupid heads! Oh, I admit it's your perfect, but you know it! I guess I'll congratulate you by tearing up the little bits like confetti! Do you not like the bones breaking? <laughs> it's a little unsettling. Yeah, how do you think I felt? <laughs> I will cheer from over here! Rah, rah, Russian Bay! Hit her in the knee! If she has one, does she? I think she has knees. A whole six of them. <laughs> She's a fast one, isn't she? Oh golly, well whatever. I'll finish you off first. Me 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 me. Oh fuck. Oh. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, well, we also probably should tattle her. Yeah. No, come on. That's Mimi. She's a slightly childish shapeshifter that works for Count Black. Max is the question mark, question mark, attack is one. Just go for the head when you attack. She will briefly stop when she gets hit. That's when she'll go back for an attack. You might also hang- she'll also hang from the ceiling and throw ropies at you. <laughs> oh shit. But- what? How can you damage me? I'm supposed to be all invincible! Kelp Life's power was supposed to protect me! Rah rah, Russian Bay, you can hit her now, dear! For this is no normal cheer! This cheer is magic, woo! My her magic barrier is through! What? When did this happen? Eek! I feel completely naked, how could you? I don't like that sh I mean, she technically has like a dress on, but I don't like the imagery. Make her lose her legs. Hee <laughs> hee, on you, dearie. Now you shall see the a way a good cheer wins the day. You're throwing up my combos, Merle. <laughs> oh shit. I am on the offense, I'm trying! Yes, yes, our team's the best. Go team! I don't think that rhymed, girl. I don't think so. I, I literally have her in a co Oh, I don't like the way she's spazzing. Me, me, me. <laughs> but how could you? It's impossible. How? <laughs> Mario's Mom, just staring at, <laughs> at the explosions. Uh, don't think you've beaten me for good, dummies. Next time won't be so lucky. Remember that, stupid heads. <laughs> Blow up. Man, these damn legs are in the way. I can't run legs. <laughs> Fine job with that, Merle. Yes, the pure heart safe. Evil's repressed. You know the tenants here guarded it for oh, one thousand five hundred years, waiting for you to draw near. Finally, that duty's gone, and I'm ecstatic for one. But wait, ere we finish up, I must tell you something. Yup. Yup. So, the light Pernoticus was read by you, yes? I was writ- it was written there that I and my ancestors waited by in the pure heart, staying pry. But something wasn't written there, and of it you must beware. There is another prophecy. A chaos- a heart of chaos will only be beaten by four and mystery. Four heroes unite, their hope burns forth light to shatter the walls of blight. That is how despair it dies. Such we will. S such is what we prophesy. Such is what we prophesy here in the home of the wise. Four heroes! Man, I know I need like two people, and it's Mario and me! <laughs> what if what, she's like, yeah, of course! Me, Mario, Tippy, and that guy! <laughs> And there's like, my name is Throw, assholes. <laughs> and then she's like, no, I actually meant 
Slim! Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, bro! Yeah, he's like, yo, man, this is great! <laughs> I am sure the pair of you, Mario and Peach, you two, are the first of Heroes Trail. So then it falls to you to find the other heroes too. I would guess if I had to, the others might be known to you. It's Luigi and Bowser. Wow, I can't believe you fucking guessed it. <laughs> I thought you never played this game before. <laughs> now finally, let me be. I hereby do my sworn duty. There, from me it parts. Here, heroes, a pure of heart. They're doing a little dancey dance. You got a pure heart! Aw, oh, see. Here we go again. <laughs> End of chapter! Count Black's servant Mimi had laid a nasty trap for Mario and friends. But with the help of Merli, faithful defender of the pure heart, the day was won. But who were the other two heroes mentioned by Merli? With five pure hearts yet to be found, Mario knew this adventure had only begun. Would you like to save your progress? Yes. Yeah! And we'll probably continue this shit in the next one. Yep. <sighs> I'm tired, you little guy. It was a long episode. We did a lot. Yep. In the next one, we'll get to see who we're going to be going off against. I was trying to make like a funny rhyme, you know, to match Merle, but uh... You may have not gotten the funny rhyme, but you'll get it in due time. <laughs> wow, thank you for that. Anyways, till next time everyone. Alright, bye! Bye-bye!